course is uh, just over 16 miles. We had 920 registered racers. Do you like Phil's World? Love it. It's pretty cool. fun, huh? <laughs> and have you guys ever ridden it in the rain? No. No. I, I heard these trails are awesome when it's wet. We'll let you know. That's why I'm, let that's me why know. Please race. let me yeah. know. Okay. Yeah. Oh. You started running in bike shoes, rocks. With my booties on. <laughs> With your booties big on. big holes in them now. Oh, no. <laughs> um, that was interesting. Yeah? It was good for the first 20 minutes or so. Okay. And then, and then it started raining. <laughs> and then the rain turned to snow. The rocks were slippery. Oh. And the corners were slippery. Yeah. Super slick right here. The single speeders are doing pretty well today. 3D single speed. It's a hardtail bike. Um, I think it's optimal conditions for the single speed today. You don't have to worry about all the gears going through the gears and we stuff. We saw so. a couple people with yeah. some derailleur problems today. Yeah. My derailleur just wadded up in the back wheel, so I ran it in from there. Look at to that! The top of the hill and then... Think about the fat, all the fat bikers out here. I'd be interested to see how they do later on now that it's starting to soften up and get really muddy. I'll probably run a pressure of 21 PSI and that lower tire pressure gives you a better feel of the trail, gives you more tire on the ground and so you have better traction. And on the slick wet rocks, I think it would be a little bit better. What kind of bike is this? Uh, I'm running just a 29er full suspension. It's their race build. Okay. Um, today, it might not be the best option just because it's so muddy and slick and the more moving parts you have going on, the more chance that something could go wrong. Clausen, and this is Behind Bars.